Well, good morning, folks. We are out on St. Croix again, back out in the boat, high water, but uh, apparently we're just under the no-wake zone. It's been lifted, so we're gonna do a, a little movement around. Uh, gonna be out in that Prescott area. Should be fun, should catch some fish. Guys, thanks for coming with me. Let's go get them. Alright guys, for those of you who have asked me before, how do I rig my jigs? So we go through the mouth. I don't know if you can see that. We go right through the mouth, through the back of the head as far as we can go. And what that does is it eliminates this minnow from spinning, the fat head. Then we take our stinger and we stick it back as far as far as we can go. Make sure the jig is sitting straight. And that's it, folks. Pretty easy. What a beautiful day. Good start. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Fish on. Very strong, whatever it is. What do you guys think? Looks like we got our first sheephead coming in the boat. And he's off. Darn, does that not break my heart? <laughs> Doesn't break my heart a bit. All right, let's check our bait and continue on. So maybe the fish that I'm seeing in the 15 feet, it's always a bad sign to start out with uh, sheephead freshwater drum whatever you want to call them so uh, because usually walleyes don't hang out with them you may get a straggler but most likely it's not the case so let's move forward let's continue to look all right so there we go there we go folks it's a small sauger Got to be all of, I don't know, 10 inches. Uh, hey, if there's one, there's more. Let's let him go. There we go. Let's see what we got. Feels like the right species, but it's not. Didn't even know he had it. There we go. Something not real big. White bass. White bass, folks. White bass. What did I always tell you about white bass? There is always walleyes around when you find white bass. There you go, folks. Just a little white bass, but that means we got a good chance of finding some walleyes now. There we go, folks. And just a mini sauger. Well, you were hungry. There we go, another one guys, little mini sauger. Let's let him go. There's a lot of fish down there. There we go. Another little sauger. Guys, I think I came to the baby factory. Let's let him go. We found our saugers, and truthfully, folks, that most people would not take those, but they would take a 
10 inch perch and these are so much better so uh, yeah truthfully you could you could definitely get your little fill out of some little saugers out here uh, but that's not what we're after today but I love seeing them here we're gonna have some good sizes coming there we go oh look another white bass honestly I'm already getting tired of catching these guys let's let them go there we go And there goes another little sauger. Yeah, I don't want to keep playing with saugers. There we go, hit it on the drop. Another white bass, folks, another white bass. All right, guys, trying a new little area here. It's showing fish and uh, not sure what they are yet. Hopefully we'll all find out together. There we go. There we go, folks. A better soccer, soccer. There we go. So now we know we got some fish over here finding uh, the little bigger ones. Let's let them go. There we go. Again, wrong species. Big old cows. There we go. It's got a lot of spin to it. Yes, it does. And we are done with these guys. Moving on, moving on. There we go. Small. Sauger. Actually, this feels like the right one. Oh, well, it did right up to there. Now it feels all kinds of walleye. All right, folks. We finally got the fish that we wanted. And uh, we're going to let her rest a minute. Then I'll show her to you. It's a pretty nice girl. All right, guys. 19 and a half inch. And she's going back in the water. What a fun fish. And, uh, man, it took all day to get one. All right, let's let her go. You know, guys, sometimes patient pays. And uh, we were patient a lot, a lot. Well, we got ourselves a nice one. We're gonna run back through the same area. Let's see if we can't plug up another one. That was in uh, 17 and a half feet of water. Another walleye. It's gonna be short, but we'll show them to you anyway. Okay, 14 and a half or half inch shy of being an actual keeper, and uh, we're gonna let them go. All right, folks, that's it. That's a wrap for me out on the St. Croix today. It was nice to zoom up and down this river. I was looking for spots that weren't community spots, did find them, caught a bunch of fish today, and uh, it, was, it was a good time. As always, thanks for joining me today. If you guys like these videos, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and there'll be a lot more on the two rivers. And as always, we'll see you on the water.